Hello there. Did you know that in Australia, raising pigs and making smoked meats isn't just a job, it's a big money-making opportunity? Let's explore together. Drop a one if you're ready to dive in. Did you know? In Australia, the pig farming industry is robust, with approximately 2.5 million pigs raised annually. Every year, Australians consume about 600,000 tons of pork. Despite Australia's large pig population, it only accounts for about 0.3% of the world's total pigs. Globally, there are an estimated 770 million pigs. While Australia's pork industry significantly contributes to the national economy, most of the pork is consumed domestically. Pig farms in Australia open up a fairy tale world. If you're someone who loves the peaceful countryside scenery, this is paradise. Pigs delight in mud baths and playfulness on lush green pastures. Absolutely wonderful. From a distance, the farm appears simple, but in reality, the pen areas are modernly designed with all conveniences. Pigs undergo health checks three times a year regularly. Piglets receive special care with tailored feeding and sleeping routines. Adult pigs are also well cared for, each having their own separate accommodations. Farm staff regularly assess the pig's conditions weekly, ensuring each pig is healthy and happy. This serene setting is surely something you can only find in Australia. Leave a one if you agree. They are cared for so attentively that it could be called living like royalty. Pigs are released from their pens at the age of five, six months, weighing ideally around 250, 280 pounds. Upon release, pigs even have their own vehicle, fully equipped for transportation. Pigs line up eagerly to board the vehicle. Imagine a luxurious limousine, but instead of Hollywood stars inside, there are pigs wagging their tails. Who says pigs don't know how to enjoy life? They are transported like VIP guests with cool air conditioning and sometimes even gentle background music to reduce stress. Australia has dozens of smoked meat processing plants catering to both domestic and export markets. Dorsania is a renowned smoked meat processing plant in Western Australia. This facility is famous for its modern process of producing smoked meats, which includes selecting high-quality pork, brining, seasoning, and smoking in special ovens to create distinctive, delicious flavors. Feeling hungry yet? After smoking, the meat is rapidly chilled and carefully packaged to maintain its freshness. Dorsania has the capacity to produce thousands of tons of smoked meat annually, supplying supermarkets, restaurants, and eateries across Australia. Smoked meat is a famous and essential dish in Australian cuisine, 
introduced in the 19th century by the British. Australians enjoy smoked meat for breakfast with eggs and toast, for lunch in sandwiches and salads, and at barbecues. Smoked meat represents a blend of tradition and modernity. It appears at gatherings and festivals, creating a warm and friendly atmosphere, and contributing to Australia's unique culinary identity. In Australia, traditional smoked meat production regions like Tasmania and New South Wales are renowned. Here, smoked meats are crafted manually following secret recipes of the local residents. The price of traditional smoked meat in these regions ranges from approximately $8 to $12 per pound. Brazil is currently the world's largest producer of oranges. The country's orange production accounts for approximately 37% of the world's total. Brazil boasts thousands of orange groves, mainly concentrated in the southern and southeastern regions such as Esso Paulo, Minas Gerais, and Bahia. The soil environment here ranges from slightly acidic to neutral P, with nutrient-rich organic layers and good drainage capabilities. With its warm climate and ample rainfall, Brazil has successfully cultivated and produced oranges in large quantities and high quality. Leave the number zero if you feel bored. In the south, orange farms surrounding Esso Paulo and Minas Gerais produce juicy and sweet oranges thanks to the warm climate and abundant rainfall. In the north, regions like Bahia and Pernambuco typically yield oranges with bright color and a distinctive sweet tart flavor due to hot, dry weather. Areas such as Sierra and Rio Grande do Norte are also renowned for tangy sweet oranges, ideal for making orange juice and preserves. During Brazil's orange harvest season, which primarily spans from June to September, oranges are quickly transported to processing plants to ensure freshness. A standard orange processing plant in Brazil can pack thousands to tens of thousands of oranges per day. Modern technology and production processes help maintain the quality and nutritional value of the product. In the dryers at the remote rural orange drying plant, the sound of machines echoes everywhere. After harvest, oranges are deseeded and thinly sliced before entering modern dryers. The drying process is strictly controlled to preserve the natural flavor and nutritional value of the oranges. The result is fragrant, dried orange peels, ready to brew into tea. Orange tea not only offers a wonderful flavor, but also provides health benefits like antioxidants and vitamin C, boosting the immune system and soothing the body. Brazilian oranges are among the important agricultural products exported worldwide. 
Juicy oranges from Esso Paulo and Minas Gerais regions are often shipped to major markets such as the United States and European countries. In Queensland, which is the largest mango producing region in Australia, approximately 50,000 tons of mangoes are harvested annually. Stepping onto a mango farm, you'll hear the wind rustling through tall mango trees with their lush green leaves and ripe, juicy mango fruits. Farms here harvest about 40,000 tons of mangoes each year with spring being the ideal time for farmers to begin planting new trees. The farms utilize the method of grafting onto rootstock on the mother tree. After about a month, farmers separate the young plants from the mother stem and transplant them. It takes approximately two, three years from planting to harvesting when the mango trees bloom and 105 days later, the official harvesting process begins. Imagine the sensation of hand-picking sweet, ripe mangoes from the lush green branches on these farms. If you agree, please leave a one. The journey from the mango orchards to your table is an adventure from the beautiful land of Queensland, Australia. After harvesting, the finest mangoes are selected and processed immediately at modern facilities. Here, they are cleaned, prepared, and meticulously packaged to preserve their flavor and quality. Subsequently, they are transported to supermarkets and markets worldwide. When you enjoy a cool, sweet piece of mango at your table, you're experiencing not only its excellent taste, but also the journey of care and effort from farmers and producers to bring this wonderful product to you. In Australia, there are famous mango varieties like Kensington Pride and R2-2. Kensington Pride, also known as Bowen Mango, stands out for its sweet, refreshing taste and juicy flesh. It is the most popular variety widely cultivated in Queensland. On the other hand, R2E2 has a sweet, aromatic flavor, firm flesh, and fewer seeds. This mango type is also extensively grown in other regions of Australia. Both varieties are renowned not only for their excellent taste, but also for their high quality and nutritional value favored by consumers. Sausage festivals are often fantastic opportunities for communities to enjoy delicious food, experience culture, and create memorable moments. These festivals are typically organized as street fairs or food festivals, attracting hundreds or even thousands of tourists and locals. At sausage festivals, you can indulge in a variety of specialty sausages from around the world.
Additionally, you can participate in entertainment activities such as cooking competitions, games, and musical performances. Sausage festivals are not just about enjoying good food, but also about experiencing joy and immersing oneself in the lively atmosphere of the festival. Stepping away from the horror of dog meat processing facilities, let's venture into a sausage manufacturing plant together. The sausage production process in the factory begins with employees wearing full protective gear before entering the production area, ensuring safety and hygiene during work. Next, the meat is transported to the processing area, where highly skilled technicians proceed with the next steps of the process. The meat, after quality inspection, is cut into small pieces for easy grinding. This process ensures that the meat is carefully and evenly prepared before moving on to the next step. Subsequently, the meat is mixed thoroughly with spices and other ingredients to create the distinctive flavor of the sausage. Then, the meat mixture is placed into collagen casings, where it will be shaped and cut into sausage links of desired sizes. The sausages are then dried in specialized drying machines to remove moisture and achieve the necessary firmness. The drying process also helps preserve the sausages for a long time without spoiling or rotting. Finally, the sausages are packaged in high-quality packaging, ensuring safety and convenience for consumers. This sausage production process ensures that the final product is not only delicious, but also hygienic and safe for everyone's health. Please leave a 1 if you enjoy eating sausages. Sausage is a primary ingredient in many delicious and diverse dishes around the world. From quick meals to tantalizing party dishes or main courses in daily meals, sausage always brings a unique and enticing flavor. Popular dishes with sausage include sausage sandwiches, sausage stir-fry, and sausage fried rice, among others. By combining with various vegetables and spices, sausage not only creates delicious meals, but also adds diversity and richness to the dining experience. The versatile nature of sausage, along with its bold flavor, has made it a favorite choice for many people worldwide. Do you like sausage dishes? Please leave a one. The pig farm serves as a crucial point in the supply chain of raw materials for sausage processing plants. On the farm, pigs are cared for and nurtured to high standards to ensure the quality of meat and animal health. The living environment for pigs on the farm is typically designed for comfort and convenience. They are raised in spacious pens with enough room for movement, ensuring comfort and avoiding stress.
The nutritional regime of pigs is also given special attention with the provision of nutrient-rich and diverse feed. Animal care experts closely monitor the health of pigs and adjust the feeding regimen accordingly. When reaching adolescence, pigs are selected and transported to the processing plant. This process is carried out carefully and ensures safety for the animals. The meticulous care from the pig farm ensures a quality and safe meat source for sausage production. Jackfruit is a popular fruit grown and produced in many countries around the world, but there are some countries that stand out for their export of jackfruit. Among these countries, Thailand and Indonesia are at the top with the largest production and exports. Thailand is famous for its crunchy, fragrant, and sweet jackfruit, which is widely exported to international markets such as Europe, America, and China. Vietnam is also one of the world's leading jackfruit producers, with quality products and competitive prices. Indonesia also contributes greatly to the jackfruit export market, especially from growing areas in Java and Bali. Jackfruit products from these countries are not only famous for their unique flavor, but also for their freshness. Packaging pineapples is a crucial step that determines the quality and preservation of the product. After being thoroughly cleaned and prepared, the packaging process begins. Each pineapple is carefully selected and packaged in high-quality packaging materials to ensure safety and convenience during transportation and storage. Packaging must be done carefully and accurately to prevent any pineapples from being damaged during the process. Additionally, using safe packaging materials that do not cause contamination is essential for preserving the natural flavor and quality of the pineapples. Proper packaging not only ensures the safety of the product, but also provides the best conditions for the pineapples to retain their freshness and appeal to consumers. The process of making dried jackfruit in the factory is a technical procedure carried out to preserve and produce delicious and sustainable dried jackfruit products. First, the jackfruits are carefully selected, then peeled and separated into golden-hued slices. Next, the slices are evenly arranged on trays and placed into the drying oven at specific temperatures and processing times. The drying process is conducted to remove moisture from the jackfruit without compromising its nutritional value and natural flavor. Once completed, the dried jackfruit is packaged in high-quality packaging for preservation and distribution to consumers. Farmers must carefully observe to determine the exact ripeness of jackfruit, indicated by its color transitioning to yellow and the fruit skin starting to soften. Then, with skillful hands, they use sharp knives to carefully cut each jackfruit from the tree branch, avoiding any damage to the fruit. 
The jackfruits are then transported to the processing plant, where workers will separate the seeds from the flesh and prepare the product for the market. This process requires meticulousness and care at every step, but the result is sweet, fresh, and nutritious jackfruits. You can also make other dishes from jackfruit at home. There are plenty of other interesting dishes that can be made from it. One of the most popular is jackfruit stew. Made from ripe and fragrant jackfruit, jackfruit stew has a unique and enticing flavor, often prepared with sugar, oil, and spices to create a rich taste. Moreover, jackfruit is often used as a main ingredient in salads or vegetarian dishes, providing a fresh and sweet taste. Farewell to the pineapple processing plant as we venture into a new territory, the dried jackfruit processing plant. Leave a zero if you find this video boring. In jackfruit orchards, farmers begin by carefully selecting high-quality jackfruit varieties that suit the geographical and climatic conditions of the region. They monitor the growth process of the trees from a young age, ensuring adequate water, fertilization, and protection from pests and diseases. Additionally, they regularly inspect and adjust environmental conditions to ensure the healthiest and most optimal growth for jackfruit trees, thereby producing high-quality products. If you're not a fan of eating pineapples, pineapple juice is the perfect alternative. Pineapple juice is a natural and nutritious beverage, offering the refreshing and sweet taste of fresh pineapple. To make pineapple juice, start by preparing fresh pineapples, peeled and cut into small pieces. Then, place the pineapple pieces in a blender or juicer and blend until smooth. If desired, you can add a little sugar or honey to enhance the sweetness. Finally, strain the juice to remove pulp and sediment, then pour into a glass and enjoy. Pineapple juice is an excellent choice for breakfast or refreshment in the summer. Leave a one if you enjoy pineapple juice. Pineapple not only boasts natural sweetness, but also contains plenty of vitamin C, enzymes, and antioxidants, enhancing both health and skin beauty. It's a fantastic choice for desserts or refreshing drinks during hot summer months. Join me for a stroll around a pineapple farm of American farmers. In the vast agricultural plains of the United States, there are pineapple farms with unbelievably large-scale operations, spanning thousands of hectares. These farms often rely on advanced technology and automated irrigation systems to sustain the growth of pineapple crops across vast expanses of land. Managing a large-scale pineapple farm requires meticulous organization and quality control, from caring for the crops to the harvesting process. With high-tech solutions and impressive scale, 
These farms not only contribute to America's pineapple production, but also provide stable income for farmers and farm families. Thank you for watching. Your companionship is our joy and motivation to create engaging videos every day. If you enjoyed this video, leave a 1 in the comments section. Any mistakes you point out will help us improve the quality of each video. Now goodbye and see you in the next videos. Welcome to our channel which is run by a pro team. First the channel manager, content writer, and finally the editor.